Perhaps my favorite stadium among Qatar 2022 venues is the 974 Stadium. And not only because I was lucky to be the overlay manager of this particular stadium, it is not an exaggeration to say that this stadium is one of the most exceptional in the world. The architectural idea belongs to Fenwick era Baron Architects, and the main feature of that stadium is that it is temporary and assembled from shipping containers and modular steel elements. The result is a distinctive, boldly colorful, and looks like it is made from building blocks. The legacy strategy includes dismantling the stadium after the championship and donating its elements to developing countries for the construction of smaller sports facilities. In addition to the uniqueness of the stadium as such, its architectural and planning solution should also be mentioned. It is logical and simple. But name simplicity is exactly that very high level of architectural quality, often missing in implementation for many other stadiums. The capacity of the stadium is 47,718. The shape of the stadium itself and the stand is a round polygonal geometry. On all sides, the stadium has only two tiers of stands, which provides good logistics of the stadium for spectators and services. Each floor is designed to be walked around on one level. An interesting aspect from the point of view of architectural and planning solutions is the fact that access to the stadium pitch from the site is provided through two tunnels located on the southwest and northwest sides of the stadium. That planning solution is also the result of a desire for maximum efficiency and, in turn, obviously, influenced various stadium operation activities such as pitch maintenance, safety measures, and medicine during the match. However, the experience of the FAC 2021 showed that the provided planning solution, in combination with other planning and operational measures, successfully handles all the necessary stadium operational activities. Another architectural feature that improves the quality of stadium operations is the access to the stadium for the very VIP guests. It is provided by a vehicle ramp to the level of the second floor. Whilst the entrance to the stadium for all the other groups, including teams, is provided from the ground level, this solution allows for separate flows that require special services and comply with the necessary FIFA requirements for the segregation of spectators' categories without overcomplicating all the operational processes related to transport, logistics, and flows management. The unique feature of the stadium is that the broadcast cable bridge is not a temporary scaffolding construction like usual, but is part of the stadium building. Broadcast cable bridges are a must for FWC stadiums, but they are usually rather unsightly structures that can affect on stadiums good look and require branding or cover-ups. However, in the case of the 974 Stadium, in conjunction with the overall architectural solution, the cable bridge looks completely organic and is not something foreign. The placement of the stadium in a fairly large free area was also a successful decision. The stadium is located on a picturesque cape, and in the future, this territory is planned for the arrangement of a large city park and a verdant waterfront development that will occupy the site once the stadium has gone. There is a metro station within walking distance of the stadium, which ensures the accessibility of spectators to the stadium. The necessary infrastructure of the championship is located on the territory of the stadium, without unnecessary overcomplicated planning solutions, taking into account the convenience of flows movement and segregation of groups of spectators, and the logistics of delivering goods and other vehicles. However, there are certainly challenges that we have faced during the preparation of the FAC 2021. It should be noted that for any major sports venue placed on the shore of a river or any other water obstacle, there is a challenge in terms of creating accessibility due to the limited directions of access to such a venue. In the case of the 974 Stadium, transport accessibility is provided mainly from one city traffic artery, which in turn creates a serious burden on transport operations and security. Compounding that, spectators in Qatar prefer their personal transport despite the presence of a metro station. In some way, placing the FWC infrastructure has been complicated by the presence of a large stadium infrastructural facility on the west side of it. In the case of FWC stadiums, the west side is the key area for a number of extremely sensitive functions, like guests' management and broadcast. 
So, any limitations like the close proximity of permanent facilities or just a lack of space create serious issues and challenges in terms of arranging all the necessary tournament infrastructure in that area. However, the most serious challenge was an issue that was simply difficult to notice until a certain point. Due to the fact that the stadium is completely metal, including the profile of the stands, the most serious problem was vibration, which significantly affected television broadcasts. Broadcasters are one of the key functions, which provides coverage of the event all over the world for the FWC Championship and for sure, for any other major event. Naturally, everything that negatively affects the operation of this function is obviously unacceptable for the organization of the event as a whole. Strong vibration from the stands of the stadium was transmitted to the TV platforms and, of course, spoiled the picture. However, test events are needed for the purpose of detecting and eliminating such issues in time, which was done for the FAC 2021 by means of an engineering solution for the TV platforms themselves. It is definitely fair to say that there are simply no ideal scenarios. However, the most remarkable thing in architectural and overlay planning is when you have an inherently magnificent venue and you need to find the most effective solutions for hosting an unforgettable major event. In conclusion, I would like to offer you to enjoy an unusual tour of the entire stadium prepared by the 974 drone team during the FAC 2021.